Hi, this is Mike, found with DIY TV, and today we're gonna to be putting together a deck box. I know, real exciting. But the thing I find funny is it always says easy assembly on any of this stuff. And I like to know what easy assembly means and what their definition of minimal tools required means as well. I put together a few of these and they're a pain in the butt. And a lot of this stuff like this is a pain in the butt to put together. So we're gonna put it together and hopefully give you some tips and some tricks. Let's get to it. Minimal tools, yeah. let's get, even get the thing open. So knife. Our mark on the back. This is probably the box kit. Right. Go to the other side. Now that we've got the four corners on, now we need to take four of these screws and run it uh, run it into each corner. Right here. I have my drill on the lowest setting. Yeah. Now we got eight screws that go through the piece of metal and into the lid to attach this uh, framing to the lid. I'm gonna get it scrolling. All right, so now we're gonna put this assembly together. So you take one of these pumps and take this there, is the screw in here, and then you put the bolt on. That's right. And you put this lock bolt, sorry, lock nut on the other side. All right, so we hit our first snag, but it's okay. So they, they, these instructions, I'm not sure if they ever actually use the instructions and then put these things together, but the easiest way to do these hinges is basically put them in place like you see here. So this obviously goes here. You can see this mount, this one goes here. Then the dampeners go on the inside, okay? The instructions for some reason tell you install it on this side, on both, but that's not right. So this is the way you do it. Now we're gonna move on to installing this whole unit to the actual lid using one, two, three, four screws right through the side. Okay, and just, just to make it harder, they want you to install four screws, but they drilled one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine holes in the mount. So you gotta kind of guess or look at the instructions on exactly where you have to install this. This is the kind of stuff that drives me nuts with these things, but that's okay. We'll get it together. This one. Okay, so now we're gonna attach the dampener to this additional mount here. So what it says is we take the bolt, run it through, and then we put this on here like this. And we're gonna put it through this hole here, down here. So this one was pretty, pretty straightforward. The instructions did throw us off, but we got through it. Okay, so I spoke too soon. We put it in the wrong hole. I really don't understand why you would make something and add so many holes that aren't used. I love putting deck boxes together. <laughs> so it goes into this hole, not that hole, all right? So we're gonna follow with the instructions and I have to fix that side now too. So this is redo number, number two, three. three How many times have we taken things apart that we put together already on this? All right, so now we're gonna put the lid on. We're gonna attach it back here to this, to these mounts here. It's nice, actually. So these go on the top or bottom? The top. So our bolts and nuts, they go on the top, top two screws, top two holes, I'm sorry. Pretty self-explanatory, kind of one of those. Put a nut there. We're not gonna tighten these up all the way until the end. And another bolt there. This, this step is pretty simple. Hopefully I don't have to take it apart and redo it. I love deck boxes. Did I say that? Okay, then we finish up with these two screws on the bottom. And these are just going right into the plastic. No nuts for this. All right, so that's how you put a deck box together. The only 
tools I needed was a drill, a manual screwdriver, because you don't want to use this to torque it all the way down, and a wrench. So you pretty much can put this together. Um, follow the instructions, follow the video, like you saw. If this video was helpful, please like, please subscribe. I'm Mike, from Family DIY, and I'm out. Right, so I noticed something uh, once we got this all together. The bottom isn't in. I told you, me and deck boxes like this. We just don't get don't get along. So what we did is we brought it out here, put it on the grass, turn it upside down. I'm gonna attempt to use a mallet. So the instruction did say use a mallet. I didn't use a mallet at all. So that's probably my fault. But we can fix this. So hopefully, yeah, look at that one. And bam, that's what it's supposed to look like right in there. All right, so once again, this is Mike from Family DIY, and I'm out.